will mark two years since the devastating dam failures. As residents wait for the water to come back, the village of Sanford plans to provide something else to get people into the great outdoors. A park and track for mountain biking will give people something fun to do and help younger bikers build their confidence. TV5's Trevor Sahaki has more on the next steps. More development for kids coming soon to Sanford, the Phoenix Pump Track and Skills Park. It's like a smaller skate park for bikers. You pump through the rollers and then you pump through the berms, or the, the yeah, the berms, and that helps you uh, keep your momentum up. And the idea is not to pedal through there and to, you have to learn how to stand. You know, it just teaches good fundamentals of bicycling. Pat Billingsley came up with the idea for the park. With Sanford having the flood, you know, it's been two years since the floods happened and, you know, there still really isn't much for the kids to do where if we could get a bike park put in there, it'd be something for the kids to go outside and do. It's designed for younger bikers to help them gain confidence before going mountain biking. The features are smaller and they're lower risk. Like the features that are on the skills park, that is a raised platform that you'll be riding up on, but it's only six inches off the ground. Billingsley said the village supports the construction of the track and park and will help find a piece of land to fit it. The reason behind a phoenix rising from the ashes of some sort of destruction, I just thought it was a perfect setting for Sanford being gone through the flood. Billingsley got letters of support from Congressman John Molinar and State Representative Annette Glenn, as well as other businesses. He hopes the track will open by 2024. In Sanford, Trevor Sahaki, WNEM TV5. Billingsley and the Central Michigan Mountain Bike Association are having a spaghetti dinner to help fundraise for this track. It will be on Saturday, May 14th from 4 to 8 p.m. at the Sanford Eagles Lodge.